here's the video you requested for the Highland uh, bikes. This is the first one that I bought. It's the gray one. I actually bought two of them. First problem I had with this one was like uh, adjusting the front derailleur. The front one right here. So I replaced it with this new one right here. The problem was with the old one, it keeps rubbing on the, the chain. And I figured out the other day that because this, the crank is actually bent when it's rotating I'm not sure if you can see that it's actually wobbling side to side this front wheel right here I think I figured out what's the reason why it keeps wobbling like left and right see that it's like it just keeps doing it is I figure out that this part right here see this it's like really really bent I'm not sure because of the fork maybe it's like not even so <clears throat> not sure why it's bent like that I adjusted the brakes but the problem with this one with the green one this is a new I have a new problem in this you can see I'm about to show it but this one right here the brakes on this one doesn't really like every uh, can't use it right now but the problem with this one is it just keeps on squealing on the brakes like no matter what I do it's like front and back do you still have the problem Josh yeah yeah it's a squeak yeah yeah so now he went out to do his morning exercise with his bike he does it every day now and then he has to do a hard brake and uh, went a flat tire for some reason and the reason why it got it got flat is because this part right here was really really sharp and it wasn't like filed or deeper, whatever, and it caused this damage right here in the tire when he braked. So I have to replace this because this wasn't properly done from the manufacturer. And it caused this. Also, there is the master, the, the chain didn't have a master link. I don't know why the chain would not have a master link. But yeah, basically I bought one, two, one for each bike. That's it right there. Yeah, so this one right here, the crank is actually bent and that's what's causing it to rub. So I bought this one, a better one. So it's kind of like a wider set. Um... I'm not sure if the other one was actually also, uh, I'm not sure why the other one keeps on rubbing. He's just rubbing like crazy, both of them. Oh, where's that at? Basically, both of them are just like rubbing like crazy. See that? It's already like chewing like gouging the metal like no matter how much it, well, how I do it it just keeps on rubbing like this one right here and it does it on the middle the middle one too see this one right here is in the middle like not rubbing at all it spins fine the back one spins uh, true but this one right here, it just wobbles a lot. It's pretty obvious. I think it's because of the fork right here. It's like really bent. I know this gray one right here. Uh, the box was open and it was like everything inside here was like loose. I'm not sure if it got damaged during shipping. And that's probably, I don't know. Alright, thank you.